and welcome back. I'm Charlie and today we're going to take a look at a piece of software called Adapter. It's for uh, converting videos, audio, and images. And I'm going to post a link to this page here in the uh, description of the video. It is compatible with uh, Yosemite. And it goes on to tell you a little bit about it. We'll just scroll through here quite quickly. Video, any format. Audio, any rate. Images, well, here we go to anything and it looks pretty good. The website goes on detail about everything, it even shows you what the interface looks like. And best of all, it's free and clean. You can download it directly from the website. So if you decide you want this, and I do, I went ahead, you can go ahead and download it and I already have. And to install it, after you get the uh, file, you just open the DMG and you're gonna slide from here into here and that's it. So now we'll go down here to uh, Launchpad and we'll open up Adapter. This is my first run, so we're going to kind of do this together. Adapter needs to install or update the following component, FFmpeg. This component is required to power the back end of Adapter's media conversions. Okay, we'll go ahead and uh, install it. A new version of Adapter is available. We'll go ahead and install that too. It must have uh, updated in the last couple days because I went ahead and downloaded this DMG a couple days ago. So it's uh, downloading the update now. It'll just take it a second and we'll uh, check out the uh, software. I have a small clip from one of my Ubuntu tutorials that we'll use uh, to see how well it works. It's extracting the update now. We can install and relaunch. And here we go. Okay, so this is what we get out of the box, and this is our GUI. Drop files here or browse. Well, let's go ahead. You know, first of all, let's go ahead and eject the installer. Go ahead and um, move that over to trash. Well, let's go ahead and drop a file. It's ready. Okay, select an output file type. Video, General, Apple, wow, we've got all these. Jeez, where do we start? Here's tablets, Sony, Microsoft, Nintendo, miscellaneous cell phones, animated. General, let's go ahead and create a Matroska, which is MKV. Click this button to toggle a preview of your output. Well, nothing yet. Let's go ahead and convert. It's converting. Here's our MKV. 1920 by 1080. This is uh, Lib X264. AEC Stereo. This pop up. Adapter is free. If you've enjoyed it, rate it, etc. Maybe later. It says it's completed. All right. So let's go ahead and get info on this. 23.3 VLC. It opens up with VLC. And that's all it's going to It's going to tell us. Let's go ahead and open it up with VLC. Absolutely perfect. Well, there you have it. That was adapter. Go back. Take a look at some of the drop downs. We can uh, check for preferences. Let's say automatically check for update. Conversion complete notifications, batch single none. Okay. File, edit, window, help. Okay, well, that's going to do it for me. So, 
it does work. Here's some uh, additional settings here. Very cool program. Absolutely free. All the information you need to get it installed will be in the description of the video. That's going to end my review of Adapter. Hope you find the uh, video to be useful. If you like Adapter, go ahead and give a shout out. Even if you don't like it, leave comments about why. Okay, thank you and you folks have a great day.